you're in the second part of the course, uh, you will get together um, in groups and complete a course project. We have had all kinds of projects in the past. Um, one very popular theme is music. Um, there are a lot of projects centered around sound processing. Um, a lot of students bring together their interest in instrument as well as um, digital signal processing. Uh, we've had projects that um, designed um, an automatic tuner for guitar um, and a software teaching instrument, teaching software for someone who begins to learn um, a keyboard instrument. My project for that class was a seizure detection and alert system. And uh, my group's idea behind this was that we could uh, watch people's EMG signals um, and then also determine if they were standing up or, fly, or if they were lying down based on accelerometers and tilt meters. We were able to demonstrate a wireless system, a communication system, which uh, I primarily worked on, uh, which linked the, uh, the seizure detection system and some off-site uh, logic analyzer, which will display, well, the person's fallen, the person's good, the person's... Uh, uh, needs to, someone needs to call 911. A very uh, big emphasis we place on this course is entrepreneurship. So the type of projects we would like students to uh, work on um, ideally would have a very clear commercial motivation, a clearly defined market, and hopefully by the end of the semester um, each project has a prototype that is ready to be further developed and marketed. And for that goal Every semester we bring folks from Center for Entrepreneurship to come and give lectures on patenting, copyright, intellectual property. They also introduce students to special courses that the center offers and different opportunities and grants that they have available that students can apply. Students often um, end up learning a lot from this course. Um, to begin with, we teach them DSP, Embedded Programming, uh, FPGA. Uh, but on top of that, because the integrated nature of this course, they end up having to do a lot of uh, engineering improvisation on their part. Um, our students are very popular with employers. Um, we've had students who went on and obtained uh, job offers from Motorola, Intel, um, a TI, to name a few. I think the most unique thing about this course is um, because our goal is to produce a marketable product, students really have to put um, many little different pieces of things together that they typically don't get to do in another course, even if it is an MBE course.